Winter means falling temperatures and rising heating bills. The same goes for cities that run their own gas utilities. But one small Arkansas city is reeling after their bill came in $100,000 more than normal. The mayor tells THV 11's Mercedes McKay his town could suffer greatly. Every October, the city of Augusta signs a contract to book their gas at a set price. Well, after the recent winter storm, that bill came back increasingly higher and with a penalty. The mayor tells me it feels like his city has been hit twice with COVID. Just as everything was beginning to fall into place. We're just getting back on our feet from a year ago from, from the COVID hitting us as hard as it did. February's winter storm left the city of Augusta with another hurdle to jump. For me to sit here and accept on a piece of paper being penalized for something that Mother Nature has done. While the frigid temperatures put a strain on gas supply for days, Mayor Jeff Collins says their gas company took some of the city's stored gas and sold it because the power grid was in a state of emergency. The mayor says legally the company was able to do this because the natural disaster made it impossible to meet the terms of its contract. We get an estim estimated bill on what the bill is going to be. And when we get our est got that estimated bill is when I was stunned. Not only did that cost the city more money, Colin says they also got hit with a penalty from the company having to use extra pressure to pump the gas up. The penalty is not just like a 5 or 10 percent penalty is a uh, well over $100,000 penalty. This is where the mayor's frustrations lie because that's a charge his town of 1800 can't afford to handle. That's $100 one day per customer if, if we have to pass that cost on for one day, a $100 penalty which is passed down. Colin says he understands the gas companies did what they had to do, but a charge this size doesn't feel right. I can't set back being the mayor of Augusta and let and pass something on to the citizens of Augusta without at least standing up and putting up a fight. The city attorney tells me there is an open dialogue happening right now with the gas company and he is in evaluation mode. They just want to make sure every decision is made right so this never happens again in the future. In Augusta, Mercedes McKay, THV 11 News.